Hi everyone, this is Cyril from the Arcade Crew, and today I'm going to show you some features from the upcoming CCCP tactical RPG, The Last Spell. In this game, the apocalypse happened. Some mages triggered the end of the world by accident, and now pretty much all living things have been wiped out. There's one last city standing, but it's mostly ruins. Your role is to defend it, as well as the mages, so they can cast one spell that might save the world from utter destruction, The Last Spell. First, you have the production phase in which you can make some buildings like houses, an armor maker, a mana well, a temple, and many more. But also gain new levels, buy new gear for your heroes, heal them, and even recruit new characters. Then, you have the deployment phase. During this one, you can build some defenses, walls, watchtowers, catapults, and place your heroes as they wait for the battle. Finally, you have the main phase of the game, the combat phase. Every night, hordes of enemies will come to your city and you need to kill them all before they reach your town and attack your mages. We have what we call an asymmetric gameplay. You only have a handful of very strong heroes fighting hundreds of weak enemies. We're putting a big focus on the optimization of the damage you'll be dealing every turn, thanks to many AoE skills. In the last spell, the characters are classless. This means that all the skills you'll be able to use depend on the weapons your character will be carrying. We want to give the player this arcade feeling. Turns are quick to play and you will easily use impressive skills to slay dozens of enemies. However, the player will be challenged with the resources optimization and the synergies between the characters they'll need to find if they hope to make some progress in the game. So you'll need to start over many times to try new strategies. Finally, at the end of every night, you'll see this screen showing your score, the panic bar, and the damn souls you manage to collect. In the last spell, you have to take care of your citizen. If no enemy manages to penetrate the city walls, your panic bar will stay low and you will gain more rewards. You also earn souls when killing enemies, they will enable you to unlock new things for your next runs. And this ends this very small presentation of the last spell. We're still working on the game and we have long months of development ahead of us. But feel free to wish the game on Steam to support us and join the CCCP community on Discord.